Hey, hey, hey! Today I'm going to be sharing with you how to make these macrame keychains. It's a lovely, easy beginner's project for everyone who wants to learn macrame technique. You can actually use it later to make something even more gorgeous and more complex. So let's just start with the supplies we'll need. We're going to need three single twist cotton cords, 32 inches long, keyring, scissors, embroidery thread, hair combs and of course cello tape with beads for decorative purposes. I'm going to take my key ring out and secure it with cello tape. I'm then folding my cord in a half and basically pulling it through the key ring and we're going to just pull through the rest of the cord to secure it to the keyring just as I'm showing. We're going to do it with other two cords as well. Make sure you place them as securely as you can before the next step. I'm then going to secure the middle cord just to make sure it doesn't move because we're mainly going to be working with the side cords. You want to bend it over the top of the middle cord and then take the right one and basically push it through to the left little circle as I'm showing in the video. That's basically a knot that we just formed. You want to pull through the cords to form the knot at the very top. Make sure it's tight otherwise our keychain may fall apart. And we're going to do exactly the same thing with the other side. We're just going to turn it around so that our knots are well balanced. So that's it. We're going to just repeat this process. Every two knots I'm going to place a bead just to spice it up a little bit. To do that we're going to take the middle cord and place some cello tape on it. That's so that we can actually pull through our bead. You need to cut it a little bit, of course, as I show in the video, and then we're going to pull it through. Once you place the bead just under the two knots we just made, we're gonna want to secure the cord back and continue the process I showed you before. Once you're happy with the length of your keychain, we're going to get our embroidery thread, pull it through, cut a little bit of it, this is 16 inches in total, and look at the technique I'm going to be using to fasten the very end of the keychain. So you place a thumb on a little bit of embroidery thread so that some of it is pulling through at the top. You'll see why it's very important, but follow me exactly as I'm showing it. Secure it as well as you can. And at the very end, we're going to do this little trick that will secure it in a nice way and we won't have any knots hanging around. As you can see, I pulled the embroidery thread through and we're pulling the thread through the hoop we created then you pull it at the other side and look we created a knot under the embroidery thread that's pretty cool isn't it now just cut up the little ends to make sure it all looks nice and cute and you know what you pretty much are finished i'm just going to cut the ends of the cords just like that we then want to use our combs to brush through so it looks nice and cute and consistent not separated and then you want to give it another cut so it looks smooth and level that's it our keychains are ready this is a lovely craft i'm sure every one of you will enjoy 
enjoy making it's practical too for more crafts go to craftyhacks.com please like and subscribe that really helps the channel grow